Hello everyone and welcome to FTL Faster Than Light. This is Kyle Blaine and let's start a new game. That's my aim for this video, Wame. That was really lame. Um, <laughs> okay, let's do this. Um, so, a number of you have... <coughs> <coughs> oh, excuse me, let's start this over. Without the coughing, I'm teasing. Um, a number of you have... Uh, picked up FTL, whether it be on the new iPad release or on the computer. And a number of you have told me that you're having problems with it. So I was like, let's play some FTL, because I'm pretty decent. Um, first things first, you want more scrap when you go to the shop. Second, oh, did I lose? I have lost power to certain things. Let's lose that so I can get that. Um, first of all, what, what, what I'm looking at here is obviously I'm in a battle. But there's two things that are that are causing problems. One is that I'm inside a nebula, so my sensors don't function. Um, and then the other one, in this particular location, this section of the nebula is experiencing a plasma storm. Your main reactor can only function at half capacity. So, <coughs> excuse me. What I did was, this is how I ended up here. What I did was I took um, away from my health and I put it into my burst laser. But now I'm realizing that's probably actually not the best thing to do. Um, I'm in an odd predicament because do I want to put it into my shields or put it into my weapons? I'm actually going to put it in my weapons and trust that I can take out their weapons really quick. And I'm hoping that they as well don't have any shields. So I'm going to attack. Why can't I? There we go. Um, so I'm going to attack their weapons first. Usually I would do shields, but in this case I'm going to do weapons. Oh, and he does have a droid which stinks so let's let's do the droid and let's do the droid and the weapons down that's fine attack systems that aren't powered okay so his weapons are down his droids down that's perfect that's exactly what we want <coughs> oh excuse me i must be allergic to ftl and with that he's down so that was not great for a first fight because we took a good bit of hull damage um Oh, and we got some fires going on. Let's uh, open these doors. Let the fire out. <clears throat> oh, now it's in there. You come help him. That's why I hate not having the scanners online. You go make sure it hasn't entered the weapon room. Okay. So that seems good. Let's close all the doors. I'm assuming... They're good. Oh, my health is offline, so they're not going to heal right now. That's fine. Okay, fire's gone. We can jump. Why can't I jump? Oh, because I have no power to my FTL drive. That would be why. Now we can jump. Um, <coughs> I want to make one more non-store jump. Intruder is on board. Um, the question is where. Let's just get them all to the med bay, and hopefully I see where they are. Actually, here's what we're going to do. Check this out. We're going to send them all to the med bay. Okay. All right, so I know where they are now. Okay, they're in the med bay. That's fine. Their other guy went into the weapons. So what we're going to do is we're just going to let the oxygen out of there. Let the oxygen out of here. Let the oxygen out of here as well. No, we'll just do... Yeah, yeah, we'll do here. All around the weapon room, let out the oxygen. So that when he breaks into here, this is going to be no oxygen. When he breaks into here, this is going to be no oxygen. If he goes out here, there's going to be no oxygen. So anywhere he goes, including the room he's in, is losing oxygen right now. And that's fine, because that's going to kill him. My other guys, they're fine, because they're in the med bay. They're going to heal. The other guys are not. So this will be good in the end, because we'll get some uh, some fighting upgrades. You'll see over here a little pop-up when, when somebody gets an upgrade. Probably when they kill them, you'll see a little... Little strong muscular oh no it's a hand you'll see a fist and an arrow up so that's good and once once they're all killed i think i'll close the doors and go see if i can find the fourth guy because wherever he is he's not doing a very good job because he hasn't destroyed any systems yet maybe he's dead already but i'm gonna wait for the oxygen to get back up a little bit all right let's go check on him he must be gone he must have died. At least, maybe it's, maybe it was my imagination that um, there was a fourth guy, but I'm pretty sure there was a fourth guy. Oh, 
right, now we can jump to the store. See if we can buy something important. Okay. <coughs> FDL recharge booster. Um, I never get this. It basically just makes you able to 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 um, to to FTL uh, or to jump to the next sector faster. Um, hacking stun. I don't have hacking battery charger. I have no reason for that. A new crew member is a very viable option, but. Um, I'm probably going to get a weapon. Ion weapons can disable systems without causing hull damage. This ion weapon stuns crew inside the room for 5 seconds. That's pretty cool. Charge time 10 seconds. Um, what are my current charge times? I should know this. 12 and 11. So that would be pretty frequent. Heavy laser. That's every 9 seconds. And firebomb. Um, I don't want another missile. That doesn't require missiles, right? No, it does not. Um. Hmm. Um, as much as an ion stunner would be helpful, but also a new, new, another crew member would be helpful. I think I'm actually going to go, I'm going to go with the ion stunner. No, because that only takes one power too. But with, if I get this one, I can go ahead and start using it. So let's do that. Because um, all we have to do, well, we can't use it quite yet, but we can almost use it. Um, I can use, well, I can use it and the burst laser, just not the Artemis. So that's good. Um, was there anything else I could buy in there? You're 45. I've got nothing I can sell. I could get the battery charger. Oh, but I don't have the back. I don't have the backup batteries. So here's what we're going to do. We're going to, um, repair our hull. And do that. And let's just go ahead and upgrade our reactor. So that now we can power both weapons that we want to. We're going to do these two. And... For now, let's take our equipment. You want to make sure the one, the weapon to the furthest right and sequentially to the left, those are the ones that will deactivate first if you run out of power in that system. So in other words, I'm most likely planning on using the ion stunner and the burst laser, so I'm putting Artemis on number three because if I lose power, um, it would go from there first and then it would go from the burst laser and then it would go from the ion stunner. Um which technically, I guess I want them this way. Oh, I didn't realize I can do it here. I just kind of naturally did that. Cool. So let's move on, shall we? Board the station and look for survivors. Um, excuse me. Faint life signatures on board. I usually don't do this, but for the sake of entertainment and learning, let's board the station. All around you is the stench of death and decay. The life sign readings must have been malfunctioning because you really doubt anything could be alive in here. You quickly return to the ship. I got 10 scrap. Okay, well, that's good. Usually that could potentially end up very, 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 very bad. Okay, um, this is a new type of planet that causes ion pulses, and I hate it. I hate it. I hate it. Okay, so we want to do burst laser on auto fire, and you at, do they have, he hasn't released their droid if they have one. It must be a it must be a droid on their ship. So let's see how this ion stunner does. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know ion blast coming in. Well, that worked pretty well. Wait. Oh, I did it backwards. <laughs> Whoops. Uh, my shields are down because of the ion blast, but that's it. That's okay. Okay, they're preparing to charge their FTL drive. What that means is I want to target their piloting system and their engines. Um, but the truth is, I'm gonna kill them right here. And then it tells me F enemy FTL delayed. And they're a goner. Okay, that's good. That was an easy fight. No no damage done that I can tell. Fuel is good. Missiles are good. Um, droid parts are good. Are they droid parts? Is that what it's called? Um, ooh! A small merchant ship messages you. Underground Federation comm channels are all talking about your secret mission. Let us install a weapon to help. Good luck. This is a flat cannon. Not only is it a flat cannon, <coughs> this joker's a flat cannon Mark II. Fires a blast of debris across a random area, doing up to seven dam damage. Um, good at taking down shields, but hard to aim. Charge time's 21 seconds. Shots per charge is seven. This is incredible. I don't think I've ever had a flak Mark II. Flak is one of the new, is one of the new weapons in the advanced edition. Um, or the, 
I guess I think it's called the Advanced Edition. Enhanced, that's what it is. Um, which is, it's not like a paid expansion, which was cool. It's just free with the game. Um, yeah, I really like that. That's awesome. Um, hmm. So, my new goal is to get weapons up. <laughs> Way up. Um, for now, I can go ahead and do this. And I can charge my <coughs> my missiles, and that's good. And if I needed to, I could do this and rely on the flak to do the work for me. But I'm I, that's that's it, 21 seconds is a really long time to wait before I can do a real attack. Um, let's go on down here. I like visiting places that will then lead me to more places. <laughs> Excuse me as I take a sip. Hmm. Mm -hmm. So we're going to hop back this way <coughs> and then head toward the exit. Scans reveal nothing. Boring. Such a shame when that happens. Oh. I hate this. This, is, this, is, uh, this one, when you see the big, 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 bright, scary sun, you're too close to a star. Solar flares will light the ship on fire. Shields will reduce the effect. Um, so we want to do... Um, ion stunner on the shields missile on the droid and lasers on the weapons and let's go I have auto fire on so I want to make sure I don't auto fire I, I, I hate auto firing my missiles that's just too dangerous so they're going to shoot from the ship and they're going to hit me because and I need to go get that repaired quickly um yeah uh what was I saying? I don't remember what I was saying, but that's scary because my shields are down and there's about to be a solar flare. So some, my ship's about to get caught on fire. Like, seriously. Something fierce. Here it comes. Get those shields fixed. Okay, shields are back online. Oh, they didn't get in there quick enough. That's okay. That's okay. This is an easy one to fix. Easy peasy. Easy peasy. I'm going to leave him in the shield room for now, even though he had been in the weapon room because... Oh, I can jump. Good. Um... There's a store, but I don't really have enough scrap to do anything, so we're going to head on this way. And the fires are still going on. That's okay, though. Um, it'll, there's still one. Go ahead and close these up. That's not really a big deal. Ion stunner there. Um, actually, let's do it this way. Let's do the iron stunner on the droid. Missile on the shield. Try some different tactics, and then lasers on the weapons. And go with that. And now we can close. Okay. Okay, he does have a missile, which isn't good. Okay, I've got my guy in there. That's fine. Shields are down. This is good. Um, this is an awful offer. Uh, one missile, one scrap, or 11 scrap, and one droid part? No, we're not going to accept. Just so you know, though, what I've found is generally with their, off, with their first offer like this, you'll have more fuel, which in this case I have none, um, and, and, and less scrap. But if you kill them, you'll get less fuel and more scrap. Um, and right now I'd like more scraps, so we're going to not take the offer and just kill him. Which should happen pretty quickly. Oh, I just realized we're in another solar flare area. That's no good. Okay, they're gone. Solar flare imminent. My shields are up. Oh, and I just got a little bit more scrap. Oh, and I got a fuel. That's interesting. Okay, got one fire. No big deal. Hurry up, FTL. Good. Okay, um, we're going to go this way. Yeah, we're just going to go to this one. A missile shoots across your bow and the drum... Uh, we're not expecting coming to stay out of this uh, profit. Um, I, I could use those missiles. That's, that's a free... That's a free no-fight solution. I'll take that. I normally would fight them, by the way. Aid the Federation ship. Always aid. Okay, we're going to do the same thing we did last time where we did Ion Stunner on the droid, um, missiles on the shield, and lasers on their weapons. Okay, they have a combat drone. Drone parts, not droid. Droid, drone. Drone is the right term. That's good, he keeps missing. This is fantastic. Good, weapons and shields are down. Um, let's, let's stun the pilot. 
And let's do... Let's not do... Let's not shoot another missile. We're wasting missiles. That's why I hate having autopilot on. Good. Or auto fire on. Uh-oh. I miscalculated. I thought we were going to be outside and be in the safe range. Um, because we're about to run into a big bad boss battle, basically. Um, can I do this? Let's see if we can upgrade our shields. We can... Oh my goodness. We are one point away so what we'll do is we'll back that down so we can add another shield um and with that we'll up this which will up our evade because we could 15 20 okay <coughs> no big deal all right let's do this so we're gonna have to fight a federation ship that's okay um he's pretty weak he can board us and i'm sure he will because they always do um so let's he doesn't have any drones though He's got some bad weapons. Let's do the ion stunner at the weapons. Missile at the shield and laser at the weapons. Because that's a... Uh, I think it's a flat cannon. Okay. So they did send somebody in, but he's in the med bay. So I'm going to go ahead and go fight him. Because I'm a win. That's an easy, easy choice there. Usually I try to suffocate, but not when they enter in the med bay. Come on. Oh, yes. Okay. This is beautiful. Because if you see what happened here, their flat cannon... Because I destroyed half of their weapons, their flat cannon had to be put away. This is good. I do not want that flat cannon to fire. Um, everything's good. Let's 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 no. Let's do another missile at their shields. Okay. So their guy ran back to their ship. So I'm gonna go back to my shields. This is good. Let's not fire another missile. Don't need that. Just keep everything the same. Yes. This is great. Because of the ion stunner and the burst laser, they weren't able to get a shot off on us, I don't think. Let's go for their shields. Let's ion stun the, dot, uh, the tele teleporter. Whatever, it doesn't matter. They're about to die. That's good. We probably will get... Oh, we got one fuel. I was thinking we might get something good for that. Um, let's go to... We're going to go this way, not because I don't want to go to the red, but because I hate nebulas, and there's two unavoidable nebulas this way. So we're going to go up this direction. Okay. There's a store, but we have no scrap to spend on it. So we're going to go to the distress beacon first. Distress beacon first. I feel like I didn't enunciate that well. Try to shield your ship with theirs. Let's go ahead and do that. Only took forward hull damage. Got 18 scrap for it. Not too bad. Those I usually do try to protect because mm, it's just not, it's not that big of a deal. Attempt to help the ship by prying them apart. Uh, sure. To your surprise, one of the NG vessels attacks. One ship detaches itself, surprisingly it's still quite whole, and opens fire. No problem at all. Ion stunner on the droid, laser on the weapons, and missile on the shields. Same thing we've kind of been doing when they have... Oh, don't shoot the missile because that's a defense drone. That won't do any good. So let's... Let's see if the ion stunner takes him off, takes it offline. It did not. That's okay. Their their weapons are down. We just won't do the. We just won't shoot the missile this time. Let's do that there. Burst laser on. No burst laser on here. So they can't go away. That's good. Now we'll do there and here. No, let's do the oxygen. No, oh, we, we better do weapons. Okay. Oh, they were about to die anyway. So I don't know why. I, I never pay attention to their hull. I really should. Because I just think about what I should do if they don't die. Okay, there's a store up here, but I can't go forward from there. I can only go forward from here. I really would like more scrap going into a store, but that's okay. Um, truth be told, I could like sell the flat cannon. How much would that sell for? 40? It's not worth 40. It's worth much more than 40. Drone control, mind control, hacking chain ion this weapon's ion damage increases oh it, it, the damage increases okay hmm interesting i thought the chain ones went faster this laser can charge two times okay i don't care about that oh oh it's a weapon pre-igniter i want that so bad but i need a hundred more scrap what this does is when you go into battle your weapons are ready so awesome um, so there's nothing really I want here. I don't even want to repair because I want to save up my scrap. Oh my goodness. There's like, this is the only path to this half of the side of the, of the sector. 
So we're, I think we're going to finish this sector and then we're going to call it, which is pretty good doing two sectors for one video. Um, okay, yeah, we can uh, search the ship before the area. Ship without life forms within a new... Uh, sure, it says there's no life forms. Oh, you find what appears to be pieces of a derelict ship coated with ice or crystal. So anyways, they hurt, they hurt me, basically. No big deal, whatever. Um, what we can do now is increase our bars and put one more power in two engines and we need to start saving up and putting more power available into the weapons <laughs> there okay that increases our dodge evade chance back up to 20 uh, let's head to this distress beacon because distress means stuff give them fuel Let's see what the... Because uh, usually... Here's the thing. If you give someone fuel, they'll often do something for you. So let's give them fuel. Thank you. Here are th 37 scrap. That's a good deal. I am I am really glad that I gave them fuel because 37 scrap is great for fuel. Okay. All of these will reach the exit. So let's just start working our way around with this one. <clears throat> you arrive at a system immediately discover a pirate ship nearby. Strangely. Okay. No big deal. Um, we can now upgrade the weapons. Um, let's go ahead and do another power as well. Because now we can do this. So now we're looking at no burst laser. But we have an ion stunner, missiles, and flak. I really just want to use that flak cannon. That, that's not great, but we're going we're gonna to try doing that. Um, it would be better just to keep using the burst laser, I think, but we'll see what happens. I think we'll get one more jump out of this before we have to mosey on to the exit. So, uh, Federation encrypted was broadcast from a nearby planet. Send in a way. Uh, I I don't I don't I don't have enough crew members to risk it, so I'm gonna I'm gonna chicken out on that one. <clears throat> Um, sell three drone parts. Oh, yes, yes. Let's sell drone parts for scrap because I don't plan on using drones in this run. Um, okay, that's good because now we can... No, we got to wait till 75. And then I'll be able to change out the Artemis for the burst laser. So let's go on to the next sector. And, uh, and then we'll call it. Alrighty, folks, let's take a quick look at the sector just to give you a preview of what's going to happen. We've got a store nearby. What we'll probably do is hop out here, then here, then here, and then no, maybe we'll head straight for the store. Maybe. I don't know. We'll see. All right, guys, we will check y'all later. This has been Kyle Blaine Plays FTL. If you like to give it a like, um, I will... I'm, I'm really hoping to get at least to the end boss in this one just so y'all can see the whole process because I know a lot of you... Steve and Steven, or I should say Steven and Stefan, uh, included, <laughs> always talk about how hard this game is, and it's really not too bad, you just gotta, you just gotta pause and think about what you're doing, man, my ship looks good with that flat cannon, alright guys, I'm out of here, adios deuces, peace!